Hello and welcome. How's everyone doing? I'm doing fine. Today it's pretty cloudy and it's pretty cold. It's around 3 degrees Celsius as you can see. I'm gonna put the Fahrenheit conversion on screen. So, today's video is going to be about how to use modern RAW files in older versions of Photoshop or Lightroom. So if you're still using Photoshop CS6 or Lightroom 4 or 5.5 for example you still can use your modern RAW files if you don't want to upgrade to uh, Adobe's Creative Cloud subscription based software so to do that you're going to go to your browser and type CS3 to DNG or your RAW file to DNG or Adobe Digital Negative Converter and then click on it take Adobe Solutions so you're sure that it's a quality product without viruses. So scroll down and then download it for Mac or for Windows. I'm on Windows, so I'm gonna take the Windows version. See you after the download has finished. Here we go. I installed Adobe DNG Converter and here it is. And I already selected the folder, which is this one with the RAWs inside. So let me do it again. So here we go, it's going to say there's no match for your search. It doesn't matter, click on select. And then if you want to include pictures within subfolders, select it. Or if you want to skip pictures if the file already exists, you can select this one. And then click on convert and wait. Now you can see the conversion status. Wait. And you can see that now it has been converted press on OK, open your folder and here you can see that you have your DNG files. I hope you liked this video, don't forget to like so this video can spread to more people. A subscription would be amazing. See you in the next one.